Hello, I'm Freya, I'm a fifth year medic and I'm from London. Growing up, um, knowing that I was LGBTQ, uh, when I was younger I did find it very difficult to um, come to terms with and uh, accept myself and it took me a long time uh, to come out to anyone. Uh, so I, I knew very, very early on when I was about 12 that I was queer in some shape or form um, and it was only until I was 17 that I really started to come out to people um, and when I did start to come out to people it was like a huge weight off my shoulders and I found that a lot of my friends were really accepting of uh, that part of me um, and it was only really when I came to uni that I properly started to engage with being queer and um, introducing myself into the community and getting involved with activities and that was when I properly started to feel like I could accept myself and uh, celebrate it. When I did come to uni, I, I did look at all the university Stonewall rankings and I saw that Imperial was actually ranked quite highly, so I felt slightly more reassured that Imperial was going to be an accepting place for LGBTQ people. And before I arrived, I'd already Googled the women's rugby team. That was my first uh, queer community that I engaged with at Imperial um, and since I've been involved in other queer spaces as well Imperial which has been really nice. So I think Imperial is an accepting place for queer students. Um, I think now that we have all this great visibility with the rainbow lanyards uh, with staff it means it's so much easier to find people to look up to and find role models. Yeah, I think London's brilliant for queer people. I think it's great for being a student in. And there's so many communities out there that you can engage in and people will be welcoming and accepting of you. My advice to students who are thinking of coming here is to not worry about uh, not being able to find your community. Uh, before I came here, I was worried about that. and. Uh, pretty much the first day at Freshers' Fair, I found them. One, two, three! Oh!